All right, so this is for part B. You've completed part A here. Now we're on to Gay-Lussac's law, part B. I've entered my data in degrees Kelvin and my pressure. I didn't include any uh, letters, only numbers, and it made this graph for me here. Now I need to make my trend line. So I'm gonna right click on this graph by clicking with two fingers. Go to advanced edit, and down at the bottom here, there should be a place to add a trend line. I want a linear trend line. And then I may also want uh, want an equation later. So I'm going to click that just because I might want that information. I'm going to hit update. And there's my graph. If I want to copy and paste it to the other sheet, then I click on it and hit Control-C and then Control-V on the second uh, document.